My dear brother, at last I am able to send you some teethings of my knife. Soon after you left me on Saturday, I was fortunate enough to find out in what part of London they were. The particulars I reserve till we meet. It is enough to know they are discovered. I have seen them both. Then it is as I always hoped, cried Jane. They are married. Elizabeth read on. They are not married, nor can I find there was any intention of being so. But if you are willing to perform the engagement which I have ventured to make on your side, I hope it will not be long before they are. All that is wrecked of you is to as as to your da daughter by settlement her equal share of the five thousand pounds set among your children after the decades of Yourself and my sister and M Oreo over to enter into engagement of allowing her during your life one hundred pounds per annum. I shall send this by express that no time may be lost in bringing me your answer. You will easily comprehend from these particulars that Miss Mr Wickham Wickham circumstances are not so hopeless as they are generally believed to be. The world has been deceived in that respect and I am happy happy to say there will be some little money even though even when all his debt debt are dis discharged to settle on my knife in addition to her own fortune if as I conclude will be the case you send me full power to in your name through throughout the 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 whole the whole of this business i will immediately give direction to hagastan hagaston for preparing a proper settlement send back send back your answer as soon as you can be careful to write Please We have judged it best that my knife should be mar married from this house of which, which I hope you will uh, prove. She come to us today. I shall write again as soon as anything more is determined on yours. ETC, God, Gardiner.